Hello and welcome to The Sacred Path. Well, the book of Acts is simply a history of the development of the early church. One of the problems that developed early in the church was that the widows and orphans were being neglected. So the disciples decided this. This is Acts chapter 6, verse 3. Therefore, brethren, select from among yourselves seven men of good reputation, full of the Spirit, and full of wisdom, whom we may put in charge of this task. But we will devote ourselves to prayer and the ministry of the Word. This statement found approval with the whole congregation, and they chose Stephen, a man full of faith and full of the Holy Spirit, and Philip, and Procurius, and Nicanor, and Timon, and Parmenius, and Nicholas, a proselyte from Antioch. Well, the next couple of chapters, um, Stephen rises to the surface. You know a lot about Stephen. These other guys are known by God, but unknown by most people. Most people today, 2,000 years later, after the fact, just read the verse and keep it moving. Let me tell you about four of these men known by God. Number one is Nicanor. He was stoned to death in Jerusalem for his faith in Jesus. Timon became the bishop of Bostra and Arabia. Procreus became the bishop of Nicomenia, and he died uh, a martyr's death. And finally, Parmenius died in peace in Jerusalem. These four men, whose names you just kind of probably just whiz by, were known to God, sometimes unknown by men. But here's what I want you to know. Being known by God is the most important thing on earth.